Hi you guys, it is Patrick. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh my gosh. It has been forever since I filmed a YouTube video. I am in college. I do school on top of this. This is not my full time thing. This is just my little work on the side. But being in college, you have roommates. If story times were still a thing here on YouTube, I would have several. But that era of YouTube has passed and long story short, Short, I had to move and whoever invented the process of moving why it is literally the most stressful process in the entire world I never want to go through it again I will have to go through it again but I have missed filming videos for you guys oh my gosh you guys don't even know the amount of joy that I get by just filming editing and posting content on a consistent basis and not doing that for the past few weeks has been um not fun oh my gosh so many of you guys are new to my channel a lot of you have watched my pumpkin spice latte video that I just posted like a month ago a lot of you have watched that and love that and if you are new to my channel then welcome and if you've been here for a hot minute then welcome back I am super super excited for today's video so about a year ago I filmed a video where I reviewed the mr. coffee iced coffee maker and that is one of the most popular videos on my channel I have used that machine so much like when I show a product I genuinely just like love it mr. coffee did not pay for that video it's not sponsored whatsoever I am a coffee based channel so it only makes sense to show you guys machines that make coffee and we are doing that again today so mr. coffee stepped their game up even more I did not think that they could do this this machine um, that I'm about to show you literally can do everything it can do everything we will get into that but let me show you guys my new toy that I picked up oh my gosh here it is ah! Okay, so I saw Mr. Coffee post that they just released some new products like a day or so ago and I freaked out. I immediately hopped onto my Target app and placed an order for this to pick it up at the store right by me and they only had like two left. I don't know how these products sell out so quickly. People love their Mr. Coffee gear. So yes, this is the Mr. Coffee Frappe Iced Plus Hot. You can make frappes, iced coffee, and hot coffee all in one machine. This is genius. So I'm thinking this is perfect for if you have a household or like a shared apartment with people who like their coffee different ways. Let's say one person loves their iced coffee, one person loves their hot coffee and one person loves their coffee blended up into a frappe you can accomplish all of that in this one machine it is genius so you don't have to have five billion different coffee makers in this one household you can just pick this up and it solves all of the problems in your life I, I can't even this is like Christmas I am so excited this is going to look great on your countertop you are going to save so much money just making drinks at home you guys if you are depending on like Starbucks or another coffee shop for your coffee every day you will not believe how much that is like added up over time it's crazy like a five dollar coffee every single day doesn't seem like a lot but it is so I was able to pick this up at Target I'm not sure where else they're selling them but I think this was around like 90 or hundred dollars it's not like the cheapest thing in the world but you are getting like a three in one so just keep that in mind and mr. coffee is a great brand I have loved all of their products like I mentioned earlier I use their iced coffee maker and I've actually used their espresso maker it's actually right there I've been using that every single day for the past few months and I love it no problems really really good quality so I cannot wait to see what this looks like <gasps> are we ready to unbox it I think we are oh oh <gasps> Oh my gosh, we have a recipe book. I live for these. This gives you like great ideas. Oh my gosh. Oh my, why is this so heavy? Can I just dump it out like this? Oh, straws. Is this a bad idea? Woo. Okay, we have our user manual right here. Oh, oh my gosh, two tumblers. I am going to have so many of these now, but they are great. They're clear. They look sleek. They look chic. They just do the job. And here is our machine. Oh, oh, oh my God. This is like a professional like blender thing. <gasps> 
tea. This is everything. Okay, uh, let me just, I can't even, I can't even. Okay, let me like try to put it together and show you guys like a break it down. I'll take you off of here and like show you more detail. Okay, you guys, this is what this machine looks like. It literally looks so sleek and like just, wow, we are multitasking here. It has this Let's Brew sticker on top and it kind of just details what you need to do depending on which drink you want to make. So this is the little coffee section where you're going to do your brewing and then over here We have our blender section So it comes with this blender cup that kind of details the measurements for everything that is just the most helpful And then we have our little buttons down here. We have on and off hot brew over ice blend and pulse You guys this is everything so they do give you two of these clear tumblers that are hand washed only apparently um um, and you can brew right in it. Wait, can you? Um, what? Um, hold on. Oh, okay, there you go. You just have to um, take the lid off. So yes, you can brew right into this cup, but you can also brew right into the blender if you are making a frappe. That is genius. Just, oh my gosh, the less dishes I have to do, the better. Oh my, you guys, if you just have this like sitting in your little coffee station, doesn't this just like feel like a professional coffee store in your own home? I am just so impressed. It will look so good. It just fits the burrito vibe. I am living for this. Now, let's get into this recipe book. I'm just going to read aloud some of the recipes that they have suggested in here. <gasps> we have a caramel frappe. Yes. Snickerdoodle frappe. Java chip. White mocha coconut. <gasps> birthday cake. <gasps> I want birthday cake. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna try that. Vegan cookies and cream. These sound amazing. And this machine comes with a scoop that makes sure that your coffee is like consistent in the amount. And they even built it in right into the side here. So it's not just like laying on top or just on the counter. You can just click it into here when you're not using it. That is genius. Okay, let me peel all of this off. And I think I have to like run it through one time just before my first uh, use. And I will be back when we are ready to try this out. I'm so excited. Okay, you guys. So I just ran this like one time with the just water. You have to do that before you use it for your first time and everything went smoothly. So now I'm going to test to see how good of a frappe this thing really makes. I'm not gonna test like the hot function or the ice function on here. One, I don't really drink hot coffee so I'm not the best like judge on that. And two, if you want to see the ice coffee then just watch my video from last year. This is just like building on that machine so I'm assuming it's gonna be about the same. So I'm just going to make the frappe today. Yay. Okay, so we have six steps that we need to complete. I think I will be able to do that. So the first thing we need to do is add water to the pitcher water line and then pour it into the reservoir. So I filled the water to the line and I'm just going to pour it. Oh, dang, should I let this like cool down? <laughs> um, I hope. The camera caught that. That was scary. Um, next, we need to add two large scoops of the coffee grounds to the filter. And this has a reusable filter. We love saving the environment. We love just cutting down on unnecessary waste. This does use a lot of coffee. Like two of this like big scoop, that is a lot of coffee grounds. But I'm sure that is just because they want the flavor to be extra concentrated. So I'm going to grab my current coffee of choice I'm using the vanilla bean brulee from Good and Gather, which is like the Target brand. I love this. If you love like vanilla sweet coffee, get this. It is the best. Two of these scoops is a ton of coffee. That's like maybe like a third of a cup. Like that is a lot, but I'm kind of here for it. Okay. Mm. Smells so good. So then the third step is to add milk and then ice using the pitcher line. I just use the Chobani oat brand. It is so good. Oat milk is the best plant milk. Why didn't we do this sooner? Like oats have been here, oats have been around. Why didn't no one think to milk them? Milk to the milk line, perfect. And then we are going to add ice to the ice line. Okay, so we are going to close this and then we are going to place 
place this under here. I love that you can just brew the coffee right into here. That is just so convenient. Okay, period. We're gonna turn it on and we're going to press over ice. Boop, and we'll let it do its magic. It's about to smell so good in here. I love this manila coffee. One thing I did notice about the tumblers that come in this kit is these straws are like really, really wide. So I'm assuming they did this because of the frappe. It's just a lot better consistency when it can actually get through the straw. So yes, love that. The frappes I'm about to make. I mean, I could have done this with my other machines, but it's just so great just having it all in one package. I love it. So it's brewing in here right on top of our milk and our ice and they use some sort of technology to make sure that the uh, coffee isn't watered down. I think it's like rapid brew or rapid chill technology. You use so much coffee grounds that when it kind of hits the ice and a little bit of that ice melts, it kind of balances it out so it's not watery. It's not too strong. It's kind of just perfect. Yay. Okay, so our coffee is all in our blender container. I'm just going to be making a basic caramel frappe today because um, I was not prepared for all the fancy recipes that they were going to be providing us. So all I have is classic caramel syrup, but that is just fine. And then just to make up for that lack of caramel, I'm going to add, and I'm just going to add all the caramel in here. Yes, yes, yes. It's going to be so good. Okay. Okay, so now I'm just going to pop on the blender lid. I don't know how this works. Oh, well, that was easy. I'm going to put it on the little, um, what are you making that noise for? Okay, so I've kind of just twisted it on there and now I can press blend. Yay! <gasps> Yay! Okay, I think we're done. Okay, oh, okay, let me twist it off. Perfect. Ah! <gasps> you guys, um, I think we just did that. Let me see, do I like twist it? Purr. Yay! Oh, this literally looks like so fancy. I can just pour it in to... Oh, well, okay then. Let me just get all of the whipped cream. I think this is my favorite part of like all frappes. Just, it gives you an excuse to eat whipped cream. Um, I love that. We have our caramel frappe right here. I need to try this out. Let's see if this machine is really all it's cracked up to be, all I frankly cracked it up to be. Um, if this works out, this is a game changer. We have iced coffee, hot coffee, frappe in one thing. Um, come on, let's go. Let's see how this tastes. This is so good, um, like so good. The flavor, it has such a concentrated coffee flavor. I think that's because we use so much coffee in one frappe, it really packs a punch. This is not like a milkshake that's kind of coffee. No, this is a frappe, coffee centered, a lot of coffee flavor. And you guys, the possibilities are endless with the amount of flavor combinations that you can do, like it's out of this world. The fact that I can make all of this in this one little blender container is just amazing. I am kind of obsessed. Oh my God, literally tastes so good. You have all of the measurements on this thing right here. The instructions are so easy. And once you get into the habit, it's just going to become second nature. You won't even have to think about it. You can just do it. If you love frappes and you want to make them part of your daily routine, um, this machine is for you. If you live in a household or an apartment where a lot of people like their coffee differently, ways this machine is for you. I am just shocked. This is amazing. Totally worth it. If you were able to go to Target and get one, I would highly recommend doing so. Again, I'm not getting anything from this. This is not sponsored. This is not provided by Mr. Coffee. I just love it and I want to share it with you guys. Um, I highly recommend this machine. This is going to become a staple on my countertop. Yes. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. If you loved it, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. If you do end up getting this machine, let me know how much you love it down below. Also be sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my future videos. Now that my living situation is a little bit different, um, I can film a lot more videos for you guys. I'm super, super excited to get back in this channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.